Hi, this is Chikadu. Throughout this month, I'm going to give you a mini talk on another look at giving. Today, our text is from Acts 20 verse 35. It is more blessed to give than to receive. Do you remember as a kid growing up, the thrill you feel whenever you receive a gift? There's something about that wrapped gift that gives you a thrill. But over the years, you've grown up an adult now, you're the one now giving gifts to people. Whenever you give gifts to somebody or you give something to somebody else, the look on that person's face, the look of thrill, excitement and happiness on that person's face also gives you that thrill that you used to feel as a young boy. The only way I can describe this is using the uh, feel-good hormones that the body releases, that the brain releases whenever you exercise. Those hormones are called the endorphins. The endorphins are actually painkillers to combat pain in your body. But when you exercise, the brain releases these hormones into your body and gives you a feel-good sensation. And you could say that giving is also therapeutic because giving also gives you this feel-good sensation. The word translated blessed from my key scripture is the Greek word makarios or makarios, which also means happy. That is why in the Beatitudes in Matthew chapter 5, in some translations, the word blessed used severally from the first verse to like verse 9 is translated happy. So if we interchange the word happy in our key verse, you could say it is happier to give than to receive. Giving is therapeutic. It is happier to give than to receive. That is how I want to start this series this month. Make this month a month of giving. Look out for people around you that are less privileged and help them out. God bless you. See you at the next one.